the good news is, is that the easiest way to create a business plan, in this case, also happens to be the smartest way to create one. And the business plan that I use for our clients and the one that I use myself is kind of a mix between two different theories or two different schools of thought. And one comes from um, a group of authors, uh, Jeffrey Timmons, Andrew Zacharias, and Stephen Spinelli, who wrote a book called Business Plans That Work. And they also wrote a book, I believe, about um, finding capital for your business. Both excellent books. I highly recommend them. The other book that I found really helpful for horse business owners is a book called uh, The One-Page Business Plan. So I would say what, what, what I came up with um, and what Pam and I have worked on together are basically sort of uh, a combination of those two schools of thoughts, of thought and then added some additional tools and, um, and forms and, and things that sort of flesh those out to where it's a really doable process. So what you end up with is basically a one-page business plan that is very clear and concise. It's more likely to contain um, short sentences, bulleted lists, and then what's going to happen with it is that to that is going to be basically like an outline that explains uh, you're just going to have on it your vision statement, your mission statement. Actually, I'm going to flip over to this this rundown here for you guys, and then I'll, I'll flip back up there. So basically, here's your here's your outline of your business plan, and and we'll make these slides available to you um, as well. So don't worry about taking notes or anything. We'll, we'll provide them for you. So. Your business plan is going to have a vision statement. It's going to have a mission statement. Typically for horse professionals, I also like to include career milestones. So that might be things that you have already accomplished and then where you see your career headed. Um, it'll have goals and objectives, strategies, and then your plans. Um, and then attached to that one page business plan that's very concise will be a, if you're planning on getting bank financing or approaching maybe a private lender or somebody who's going to invest in your business or a partner, um, you would attach a cover page and Pam's going to talk a little bit about that. And then additional financial documents, which Pam will talk about that, and your marketing plan. And I'll be talking about that piece. So that's going to give you sort of the, the idea of the type of business plan that we like to create. And the reason why we like to create this sort of simpler plan is that um, one, it's a very clear document to help you run your business. It takes less time to create, but you end up with a much more concise plan that everybody, can, you know, on your team or um, even a, an investor can understand clearly what you're trying to accomplish. I think that the days of the 20-page business plan are really over. Um, I think that sometimes people think that through a whole bunch of writing and a lot of fluff that that's going to make them, you know, a bank or an investor more interested in them or it's going to be, mean that they have a better business plan than somebody with a shorter one. I don't really think that's the case. I think that nowadays people really want you to just get to the facts and um, have a clear vision of what you're doing and be able to quickly identify what the pros and cons are with a particular business. Now, on the Equestrian Professional site, I'm going to tell you some tools that will really help you in creating uh, this concise business plan. There's a lot of, um, of prep work that goes into it, but it's sort of little chunks of time that you can use here and there. And some of the tools are our horse business assessment. Um, there's also, if you go to our fast track program, there's a how to write a business plan and there's a really good step by step in there that Pam and I worked on and you'll find a lot of tools in there. You'll also find uh, the marketing, our marketing calendars to 